Former Minister of Aviation Olua Femi Fani Kayode has revealed why the late founder of the Synagogue Church of All Nations, Prophet Temitokbe Balogun Joshua, was not liked by some Nigerian pastors. The former minister stated this in an interview with Premium Times while discussing his relationship with the late prophet. Fani Kayode said the late televangelist was a star in Christendom and it was only natural that he attracted envy and jealousy from fellow clerics. The 60-year-old politician said, There is no big man of God in this country that I do not know and respect. Like all human beings, they all have their weaknesses and strengths. If they were skeptical about TB Joshua, that is their choice and view. This is merely their opinion of him and they are entitled to it. I do not share that view. Fanny Coyote said he wasn't sure any Nigerian living or dead had as much an impact on the gospel worldwide as TB Joshua did. He also added that the late prophet was close to many world leaders but never flaunted his connections. In his words, Joshua's legacy is outstanding and many of his peers cannot handle that because they felt that his humble beginnings did not warrant or deserve it. He was much misunderstood often misrepresented, often falsely accused, and often maligned. It is actually a shame and a disgrace for any man of God to hate another. Who are these people that speak ill of T.B. Joshua and judge him? Are they God? Are they angels? Are they infallible? Are they perfect? Fanny Kayade ended by saying, Unlike many others, T.B. Joshua did not judge others and he did not think only of his pocket. Maybe that is why a few of them hated him. He reminded them of what they ought to be doing but are not doing. I do not know and I do not care. I respected him, I loved him, I admired him and I always will. <laughs>